Hey guys, long time no see again. <laughs> I don't know what it is, I'm getting really bad for not recording these episodes or um, I record them and then I, um, what did I do with the, not last week's episode, was it last week or the week before's episode? I recorded it and because obviously I upload them at night but I schedule them. I accidentally scheduled it for the following day. <laughs> instead of the day that it was supposed to go on so that was a bloody mess and then I forgot to make a thumbnail so I had to reuse a thumbnail I already used and I haven't gone back in to edit it <laughs> I'm in a bit of a disaster zone at the minute how are you how's your life going my life <laughs> it's great I'm loving it but I have fallen back into K-pop again, <laughs> like really bad. It just kind of hit me like a truck. Um, Cause I found a shop that isn't that far away from me that actually sells like imported K-pop merchandise. Um, so I can actually finally buy albums again and not having to pay like crazy um, shipping costs and then import costs. Although I did spend a lot of money this week. Um, if you're into K-pop, then you'll know that this week the pre-orders for BTS's album came out where it's going to have some, um, well, there's like three new songs, but the rest of the songs are, um, songs from previous albums and I think they're re-recording the ones from like the early albums and I didn't listen to BTS when they first came out. I think I started listening to them just before mic drop because I remember that that video being ingrained into my head. Um, but yeah, so I bought that and then I bought some Stray Kids albums and oh my god, I was in the shop, right? And there was this girl that, she was younger than me and if you don't know, I'm 26, I'll be 27 this year. She was younger than me but I, I want to say she was 18 or like, 20 or something and she was in the shop with her mum and her mum was like telling her to hurry up because she was like trying to pick what album to get and I think she was picking up like BTS albums and I was there holding my Stray Kids Ordinary and the No Easy Blue Edition and the music video for Maniac came on so I was like stood there watching I'm like oh yeah my boys and this girl goes to her mum Basically, she stood right next to me as well. She goes to her mum <laughs> and she's like, oh, my friend listens to them. I laugh at her for listening to them. And I was like, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just there with my hands full of Stray Kids merch. And she says, yeah, I laugh at my friend who listens to Stray Kids. And I'm like, ah. Anyway, this intro has been long enough about my K-pop ramble, so uh, before we jump into it, don't forget to like this video. Um, I've got scissors in my hands, please ignore. Um, don't forget to like this video if you like this type of content. <laughs> and I'm on about Sims 2 content, not me waffling on about K-pop and boys that do not know that I exist. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon, that way you will be notified when I do upload, which hasn't been a lot recently. But I'm getting back into it, I swear, I swear, I swear. Anyway, let's just jump straight into it. Alright, we are with Kaylin today because obviously, I think this is the third time we're playing her. She has obviously officially been added into the rotation, which is amazing. Also... I have a new Starbucks cup. Yes, I do have an issue, but we moved past it. It's got like a nice textured studded ones. I know that these are really popular in the States, but I don't know. But recently in the UK, we have started to get better and cooler like cups. Like normally you, you can never buy these. Like the last special cup that I got from starbucks um i had to get someone to bring it back from china because i could only get it from starbucks in china 
Um, but yeah, finally the UK and probably listen to my prayers and are like, oh yeah, we'll bring over special cups. So yeah, it just feels nice. Listen to, just listen. I'm sorry, but oh my God, it feels so good. I just want to like, oh, if I could lie on something that had like this texture, oh, beautiful. Anyway. It did have a hibiscus iced tea in it, but now it just has Coca-Cola. Anyway, <clears throat> so what's Kaylin um, doing? She wants a baby. Okay. Who's she with? Right, so she... She's currently with Benjamin. But didn't we say we wanted her to be with someone else instead of Benjamin? Like, who was she with? Was it with Benjamin? Right. Because she was in a relationship with someone and comments were like, oh, let's not have a fall for like the first guy she meets. And I was like, okay then. So I guess um, we need to find us someone. Because at the minute she's only got a crush on him. And I don't, yeah, we're, we're not going steady with him, so we're not in a relationship with him. And I forgot we got a cat called Patch. <laughs> Grows up maybe today. Okay, so I guess, are you at work today? You should have been at work. <laughs> Why are you not at work? <laughs> um, do I have to click on her to go to work? Oh, yeah, we are an hour late to work. I would say we were due for a promotion, but we're not because we still need body and logic. And she does want to gain a skill, so I guess we could focus on the body one when she gets back. Um, and I'll meet you back when she's got off from work. Kaylin is back from work. And she brought home 756 simoleons. What's she gonna do? Oh, she's getting the mail out of the box. That is great. Um, fill the bowl and then pay the bills. And while she's doing that, I want to talk about this chocolate that is new. So if you're not in the UK, you've probably not heard of this, but we sell um, chocolate by Milky Way and the like magic stars. But today, well, yesterday, I went in to the shop and they sell Med Magic Stars chocolate bar. And my mum found it online because my mum has celiacs, so which means she can't have gluten or wheat. And she, um, oh my god, let me just like walk her to a lot. Let's find some dude. Oh, downtown, where should we go? Um, we could go to the lounge um and so yeah there's this gluten-free chocolate bar which i thought chocolate was gluten-free anyway so i'm not quite sure what's happening there uh, but um when we saw it in store it's actually dairy free as well and if you don't know i can't have dairy <laughs> it just doesn't agree <laughs> with me so i have coconut milk that's what i have in my brews and what i have with my cereal and it's really good anyway they have a plain bar but they also have one with popping candy and this is what it looks like magic stars popping candy and it's so good i love it my mum tried it she didn't like it because to her it tastes like dark chocolate because it doesn't have like the milk in it to make it creamy but i love dark chocolate so that's probably why i like it even though it's not dark chocolate it's like normal chocolate but um so it's like really good and um and yeah, I'm eating a lot of it and it's I love popping candy in my chocolate. It's like really hard to find because um in the UK at Christmas years ago these Cadbury's used to sell these magic elves and they're like little elves like this chocolate and they had a popping candy inside. And I used to buy them and then one year they just decided to discontinue that like sub brand. So whenever I want popping candy in my chocolate, I have to buy it specifically from like 
you know, like a, a small business, basically. And it's like so expensive and it's like, it's like the size of this, which this is an 85 gram bar and I bet like half of it, but they'll charge like five pound for it because it's like artisan, even though it's just like chocolate with popping candy on the top. Well, this has actually got it going all the way through it. So this is mainly why I bought it because it's like a chocolate bar, a big chocolate bar with popping candy in it. So I'm like really happy. Um, and I've seen in Sainsbury's as well, if you're in the UK, they do like the individual strips of them as well. Um, but they didn't have that at the Tesco's I went to. They only had like the share bar. So I got this, so yeah. It, you you can't have dairy or you're vegan because it, it is vegan as well it says it's vegan on the back but not on the front which um doesn't make sense because if it has no dairy in it then it's obviously vegan so i don't get why they're not marketing it as a vegan chocolate and just as like gluten-free and dairy free not quite sure oh my god what's happening over here with corbin Oh, oh, a witch was arriving. Oh, those two must know each other. That's okay. Um, yeah, I, I thought my game was about to crash then, and it's not. Okay, I need a. <laughs> I was too busy talking about a chocolate. Um, so we need the um. I need a band teens because teens should not be in a lounge. Um, adjust a visitor controller. Um. Ban teens, ban children. So, I know you're a teen. You're a teen, and you're a teen. Thank you. Um, adjuster, delete adjuster. Oh, Alexander Goff's here. We can't get with him. Let's greet Amar, I guess. And then there's Brandon. Who is this guy behind the bar? Oh, he has the face template that I love. Um, let's talk to him. He's got black hair, blue eyes. What are your turn ons and offs, actually? Fitness and mechanical. Well, you might not have an attraction to him either way, but you never know. We could have some black haired babies. <laughs> she likes him, but he doesn't like her. Okay, maybe maybe talk about something else. Maybe. Um, he's like, excuse me, I've got a job to do. <laughs> Oh, Agnes Crumple Bottoms here. She didn't like that. An Andrea, Andrea was um, in a swimsuit in a hot tub. Um, oh no! Don't go to the roaches. Please do not go to the roaches. Also, uh, also Benjamin's here. Oops. Um, yeah, let's just talk. <laughs> But yeah, so if you see this, get it and let me know what you think, if you're in the UK. But I think majority of my audience is American, so maybe you can't get it. Yeah, they're all getting mad at us. So yeah, we'll do that. I'm trying to think what else I've discovered. Agnes from Paul Bottoms voice just makes me laugh. It's so weird. Also, I finally bought a phone case that I can put a card in. And I've, you might probably think in debit card. No! photo card <laughs> it's a B <laughs> but I might put um because obviously I got some photo cards with my stray kids albums I might put the one of Chang Bin in it um but it's not it, yeah I have one with him and I can't remember who which member he's in it with but I, I do have one of him on his own I think I've got them here. I put them all in my little bags. Um, this little bag to keep them in. Because I've ordered um, a... Basically, I've ordered a photo card book off Etsy. But it won't get here till like mid-May. 
which me which to me means like they oh, it pisses me off because they're like oh it's handmade but it's like no you drop shipping it from like aliexpress which is now annoying me now that i've realized that because i could have bought it for like maybe one pound as opposed to 12 <laughs> with shipping as well oh my god it pisses me off etsy's fucking load of shit anyway look at them all anyway so yeah i put them in here so yeah this is the one i have of him on his own beautiful i know um where's the other one? Oh, he's oh look at him <laughs> look at them <laughs> this is oh they're like trading cards but i would never trade these anyway i need to put all these away before i lose them again because i don't want to lose them with a bloody photo card i like cry yeah so these i'll show you like the two because these are just the two that i accidentally pulled out but basically the one that i lost was like one of these like these are like separate but i've like folded them all and put them together but it's like a really small id card of hyunjin that i've lost and i was like really upset and it's annoying because it was like 10 pound for the set of eight and i've lost one of them and then i've had to pay mm. two pound for just one on its own and then i i bought two posters as well but i misread the thing i thought it said postcards and it did not say postcards it said posters so now i've got two posters on the way as well <laughs> because i thought they were postcards but yeah those id ones i thought they were um i thought they were id not id cards <laughs> they are id cards i thought they were like photo cards and it was only when i opened them i was like oh these are like tiny why is the packaging this big i was a bit miffed but um i i know for future but yeah so are you guys into k-pop or is it just me because i don't have any single friends that are into k-pop like i went to a k-pop concert on my own back in 2019 i drove four hours away to london for bts would i do it again of course i would i'll do anything for them but it was still a hassle <laughs> bts are too big to be doing like things like that so i think they should just do like football stadiums across the country because it's getting expensive you know what i mean um and i know when i went to see bts i also wanted to see monster x because they were going to manchester but i actually couldn't get tickets i fought for my life for those tickets and i couldn't get them and I was trying to see if any was going on like the resale thing on Ticketmaster and not a single one came up and I was so upset. Okay, Kaylin's back from work. We brought home uh, another 756 simoleons. While we were at work, Patch grew up into an adult. Um, Patch has... Where are you? Patch has extremely massive ears. And has a bit of um, a unique face and I think looks very cute. So we're going to clean that, fill that up and we're going to praise for being on the pet bed. And we're also going to play with um, Patch a little bit because Patch needs some love. Patch is a boy, okay? I couldn't remember. So in my head where I've been thinking him, I have been correct. After some much needed persuasion, Vincent is now coming over. Hopefully he'll give some attention to Patch over here. Um, our hunger's a bit low and so's our energy, but we'll feed her when Vincent's here so then he can get fed. Because obviously when your sims are invited over, if they can't fulfil their wants, then they go home. Praise. And we will... Oh, I don't need to greet him. I guess we can just admire him. Oh, okay, yeah. And just walk straight in, hon. Yeah, no need for a hello. He's up for it. Flirt, charm. Um, um, uh, <laughs> 
Ooh. I'm loving it. Ooh. Yes! Suggest! The cat's just Ooh. having a piss right in front of us. We'll, we'll praise the cat while we're here, actually. Because um, I'm not sure... Yeah, because the cat isn't that smart. But it's doing good for its bladder. Um, uh, you know, like, it knows, he knows to go to the litter box, which is always very helpful. Ah, yeah. Uh, we're trying to kiss you lightly. Why are you going upstairs? There's n seriously nothing up here for you other than our bed. <gasps> Accepting the kiss. We're now friends. Maybe we could sweet talk. No, what is it with these Sims that aren't enjoying sweet talk? Just kiss him. Maybe he he just wants to kiss. Okay, so we've a twenty percent chance she could she could get pregnant from this interaction oh my god his boxes are green her underwear's green her whole aesthetic is green it's meant to be guys i'm sorry but this is who we're now pursuing for her screw benjamin he's out the picture it's now all about vincent <laughs> <laughs> Has all woohoo. Right, so she just got a push in him. The Sims' heads were even there. <laughs> Oh, and she got pregnant from that. Who knows, we might start seeing symptoms. It's been a so so week, so let's praise our cat for getting clean. Um and we'll call over Vincent because she wants to be best friends with him. Um we're like halfway there. Actually no, because you need seventy, isn't it? Which will be forty five, right, so we're like <laughs> No, that's not, no, because 4 plus 4 is 8, 45 doubled is 90, 35 is half of 7, 8, yeah, and so we're almost halfway down, god Katie, good maths, good maths. <laughs> of course he'll come, he's got nothing else better to do. The cat's just like, why am I even here? You're not paying me any attention. Oh god, our bed's messy. He's not gonna like that. We're still mad about being burgled. Let's hold hands. Maybe he'll enjoy that. No, he did not. Let's hang out and get our best friend level up. That that will work. I know it will. It did not, but it got our short term one up. So let's. Did he like attend kiss? I think he did. And I don't think we're pregnant either. So let's go to the bed. Hi Jennifer, we have the same hairstyle as you. Oh, they didn't kiss, but they're going straight in for the woohoo. I wonder if he's gonna go home. Oh, I think he did. He just didn't say bye. Rude. So she got pregnant off the first woohoo. <laughs> 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 
well, girly, you sh sure you're surely gonna get your um your baby that you wanted. Um, where are the cat toys? Oh, here they are. I want a recolor of this, but the bird being white. But we'll get blue in honor of Twitter. Clean the cat bed as well when we get a minute. Um, get leftovers. I have some pancakes. Um, is there any other cleaning that you could be doing? Macro clean. Because obviously you don't have a maid, so everything you clean, you're having to do yourself. And she can't clean the litter box. I wonder if I can cheat that. I normally obviously wouldn't, but obviously because she's a single sim, she can't clean the litter box. Because obviously she's pregnant, cheating. No, it's it's testing cheats, isn't it? Testing cheats enabled. True. See, I'm only doing that because she's pregnant and I'm not hiring a maid for the day just to clean that. Um, so, sorry, not sorry. <laughs> You're hungry again. Um, get the, the roast beef. And then you can go to bed. Okay, Kit Kat wants some attention but first we're going to fill the bowl, clean up, recycle that and then we will hug be treat, play, toss in air. Mm. Kitty kibble. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. So she got pregnant from fucking risky woo first time. Oh, she's already started receiving child support from him. <laughs> Probably can't afford it with his job Hi, oh yeah you're not Jennifer you're Lucy maybe I'll unlock this door mm. Maybe then you can go outside, maybe? Mm. I don't know. Anyway, let's focus on you. You want some chips? Uh, you want to go bed again already? Jesus. Okay, so she's woken up from her sleep. Um, cat's doing fine, obviously. I don't know when her second bump is because I never checked the time when she got her first bump. But now she's having bacon pancakes. I I would love some bacon pancakes. I would love pancakes in general. Oh, I wanted to look at the cat, but okay. <laughs> never mind. Um Cat sucks up still really bad. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, second baby bump. Alright, so she's gonna have the baby at 1am tomorrow. She just wants to eat. I think it should be turning into winter soon. That's why I'm like fast forwarding. Um, Watch it switch at 7am. Now she's sleeping. Or do we have another day? I'm not sure. But she's gonna have a shower anyway. <coughs> she wants to watch a movie, so we could do that. Can we? Fun. 
It's weird seeing her pyjamas in pink after her only wearing exclusively green for a long time. Oh! Benjamin's come over! Let's greet him and be like, yeah, let's be friends. Oh! <laughs> it's winter now. Well, I'll just do this so then I remember... Then I don't have to remember for next time. <laughs> this is awkward. Hey, I know that we were fucking, but I fuck someone else now. I'm pregnant. Mm -mm. Ask to just be friends. We told him that we're just gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, she's telling him, let's be friends. They became best friends, but then he fell in love with her. <laughs> and now he's embarrassed. Um, Are you not embarrassed? That's embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Goopy feels uncomfortable too. Uh, that's awkward. Anyway. He's falling in love with us. Oh, and now you're not into it. Okay, now the best friends. Oh, don't do that. Your mum's pregnant. Where did you go? Uh, yeah. Actually, no. Maybe we won't scold you. Um. Let's make out and then we'll leave. Why do you not like him anymore? You were loving him. It's because Benjamin came back into your life, isn't it? He had been ghosting you for like three days. The two weeks and three days. Um, and now he's fresh in your mind. Well, I'm sorry, but you got knocked up by a different man. Who knows, maybe you two will split up if you get together and then you can go back to Benjamin. Maybe Benjamin will be your the one that got away. Let's ask him out. Okay, he's saying yes now. So now if you go to Benjamin, you, uh, you're actually cheating on him. Mm. Well, guys, I don't know about you, but that was one roller coaster of an episode. Why can't all my episodes be like that? But I guess that's just how the cookie crumbles. Um, Miss Kaylin Lanarak <laughs> getting knocked up with a risky woohoo <laughs> with Vincent. Um, but then pining after your ex man who, d who originally didn't even clearly want you because he wasn't calling you up and he decided to show up after you already invited um vincent over to what confess his feelings after he saw that you moved on no no that second hand embarrassment no <laughs> where he was like oh, oh, my. oh my god i can't believe it Oh, so. Mm. Anyway, she's now in a relationship with Vincent. So I did what you guys have said. I didn't go for the first guy she got with. But with the way that how her she's now not so keen on um. Uh, what's his name? Vincent. Maybe she'll go back to Benjamin in the future. Anyway, we didn't get to progress anywhere in her career, but next week 
we are with Brandy, Freddy and Oscar. And then once we've played them, then we'll be playing Bo because last round Bo graduated from uni. Uh, don't forget to like this video if you enjoy this type of content. It really does help push my channel out to other people that enjoy Sims 3 content. And don't forget guys, when I do hit 500 subs- Oh my god, <laughs> can't get my words out. When I do hit 500 subscribers, I will be doing another giveaway. EA- don't mind me typing. EA opened up the creator network to um, anyone to apply. And my status still says pending. Rude. Um, and I applied like a day or two after it went live because I didn't understand really what it was. And I've seen some people like that have been approved or whatever. And I don't really know what it would do for me. I don't even really think I would get approved because obviously it says what games do you play and it says the sims but obviously i think they would prefer sims 4 players as opposed to little old me on sims 2 <laughs> i'm like i think i'm like one of the last people they would want on their roster <laughs> most times i've we have slated the sims 4. i don't think so so yeah i've already said like and subscribe well i don't know if i said subscribe but subscribe to my channel and make sure you press the bell icon that way you will be notified when i do upload a video which is either a Monday or Tuesday, depending how quick I can edit the video. I've done this really quick, so this might be up Monday or it might be up Tuesday. I don't know. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so with that all being said, I hope you've had an amazing week and I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys.